Welcome to Hunt a Table. I'm Linda Peterson. And I'm Dana Peterson. And today we are going to be uh, grinding some of the pork that Dana got on one of his recent hunting trips. That's right. I had the opportunity a couple months ago to go to Florida on an alligator hunt. And I was staying at this ranch and uh, while I was there, I noticed that this place was just overrun with wild hogs. And so I was more than happy to help the landowner out by cleaning out a few of these hogs because we sure like pork. All right, so what I've got here are some uh, hindquarters of some of the hogs. And of course, you can see my wife's the comedian when we wrap this. This is the moon over my hammy. And I've got some fat uh, from the sow that I had taken. This girl was a big old fat sow, and she just had fat this thick all around her. So we're gonna grind up this fat to mix in with our, with our pure uh, meat in order to get the proper ratio. I'm looking for about a 25% fat content here for our pork burgers. Started this process a couple of days ago. Wanted to just really slowly thaw this meat out. And so I've just put it in a cooler here and, and let it slowly thaw. You want to keep it just slightly frozen yet when you do the processing. It runs through the grinder a lot better and just doesn't turn the meat to mush. So let's go ahead and get started chunking this meat up. Okay, so I'm starting out here with, this is a hindquarter, so this is a ham of a hog. You can see it's still just slightly frozen. It's pretty cold to the touch, uh, but it'll work really nicely. So I'm just gonna take a knife and just start chunking meat. I do wanna point out while you're trimming up your, your quarters here, you wanna pay uh, special attention for any of these little glands here. Uh, they will certainly give a funk to your meat. So just watch what you're cutting out and make sure you get all of these glands removed. Okay, well that's the last piece I'm going to get off of this. You can see I've pretty well taken this down to the bone. Um, you know, just in trying to get the most out of everything that you have and utilize all the resource. This is a great piece right here. You can still see there's a bit of meat on here. You could boil this off in a big, big old pot of beans. You need to have some great ham and beans. Okay, I'm ready to grind up the chunked meat here first. And the first step, the first time when you run this through the grinder, you want to use your larger uh, cold uh, cutting cutting blade versus you can see the smaller one. This will be our, for our finished product once we mix the meat with the fat. But first, we want to run it through this larger size. just finished grinding the meat now I'm going to grind up the fat back and if you can get a, a nice fat hog like this and you can see this is the uh, how thick this fat was right over the top of this hog's back this is going to make some fantastic burger so I have 20 pounds of meat and fat combined here in this tub right now that I'll run through uh, one last time on the finish setting in the grinder so I have 15 pounds of meat plus five pounds of fat. So that gives us a 25% ratio of our finished product. That didn't take long, about an hour and a half. Not too shabby. This is what, 40 pounds worth of pure pork burger goodness looks like. I think it's time for us to have a barbecue. All right, I'm ready. I am hungry. Me too. Please take a moment to click the like button and make sure you subscribe to our videos as we'll be uploading new Hunt to Table videos each and every week. What are you doing now? Well, I'm looking up some recipes for um, what to do with all this stuff. How about some pickled pig's feet? What? Here's one. Here's one for cleaning brains. Cover brain with slightly salted cold water. We could use hog, can we use hog brains? You can. And my fat measured out here. And I used uh, a 25% ratio. I think that makes for a really nice uh, juicy burger. So I have a total of 20 pounds uh, in this tub here that I'm going to run through the grinder on the finished setting. Stop. Okay. Cut. Okay. 